our, uh, uh, how do you say, petroleum uh, is completely controlled by U.S. international comp uh, uh, U.S. company, which is uh, uh, belonging to a former general, a U.S. general, which was leading the NATO uh, invasion in, uh, bombing in, uh, in, uh, in the Kosovo War. And uh, as a sign of gratitude, we owe him uh, all our petroleum, and we have no access to that. So we are relied in importing with the highest price in Europe, with the lowest quality. Uh, uh, petroleum, which is also reflected in the prices of our uh, or on our daily products, because we're also completely relying on import because we have no other uh, investments or uh, industry or. Uh, but even the very few ones, due to the fact that we are mostly exporting drugs, uh, the, EU, the euro, euro is quite uh, competing with our local currency, which, but it's not real. It's, it, it's not a sign of uh, growth or development. It reflects that we do not export anything else. And it's also causing a lot of issues for the very few local exports uh, that, uh, that manufacturers or small businesses are, are uh, exporting. Uh, so yeah, it's paradise for money laundering, uh, drug uh, trafficking, and uh, uh, of course the you know, U.S. influence not just in petroleum, but you know when it comes to renewable energy, uh, there is uh, this former vice president of Amer of the U.S., Dick Cheney, which uh, has a company which, besides so many other uh, agreements with uh, PPP that it has with our government, they are also going to be the, to build the biggest hydropower dam in Europe. Uh, yes, I'll, I'll let you uh, hear. about the uh, debt in Europe, which is uh, going, they are going to be the profit on one year on that and keep it for 99 years, right? So we still have no access in that, uh, in that energy. And uh, as it usually happened also with the petroleum company, they don't pay taxes. They pretend they are losing money each year, so we have no profit, no benefit of uh, this, uh, of this. So yeah, and the, as for the EU, besides this, very vague progress, uh, progress reports about uh, the condition of democracy. For as long as, as there is no social unrest in the country, for them everything is almost almost the same. So therefore, therefore I find it quite important for us, although quite, quite as, as I was speaking in the beginning, not very relevant in the, uh, in the discussion. It's very important for us to be part of this South dialogue, and uh, I'm very looking forward for the contributions to this. Thank you.